Hey guys, today we're going to have a look at the new Chocolatey Package Manager GUI. So this is from Chocolatey and it's called Chocolatey GUI. And I'm on their GitHub page now, so it's Chocolatey slash Chocolatey GUI. And if you scroll down, there's some installation instructions. I'm going to go ahead and copy this and then pop into a terminal and run the command. And I'm going to see a warning that I need to run this as an administrator. So I'm going to close out of here and reopen a new terminal, but this time go run as administrator. And now if I run the command again, I no longer get the warning and it looks like it's going to go through. So I'm going to go ahead and hit yes here. And I'm going to let this go and install. Let's hit A to accept all these defaults here. So I'm going to let this all install and uh, and I'll fast forward to the end of the installation. All right, that was actually pretty quick to install. So let's have a look at what's next here in GitHub. So I didn't see any commands for running it. So let's just type chocolatey gooey and see what happens. And that looks like it's doing it. So there we go. We have a nice little gooey for chocolatey. If we click Chocolatey, we can see all the packages on Chocolatey. If we click on this PC, we can see all the packages that can be managed by Chocolatey. And you can see that I have Docker Compose and it's out of date. So let's go ahead and double click it. And we'll just go update. And it looks like Docker Compose is going to update here. and it still says outdated but let's go back and when we look on this main page it is no longer outdated so there's probably a way to update everything we got refresh we got update all so let's hit update all and I'm just gonna update all my packages and then come back in a minute or so here while this is going through I notice this is taking a little longer than expected it looks like we can click this console output and it tells you which step it's on so it looks like it's done quite a few things already and now it looks like it's doing some sort of update to Python 3 alright so it looks like everything completed so that's all I'm gonna show for the chocolatey GUI since this is my first time using it but as you can see it's just a nice GUI to start using chocolatey package management for Windows so if you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about Chocolatey, I suggest checking out my first video on Chocolatey, which shows you how you can use the Chocolatey command line to install and update your favorite packages.